Bipara this morning. Give you good morning. Good morning, Gina. Yeah, the medical examiner has just arrived here on the scene. They were getting ready to extract that body of the driver of the wrong way car. DPS also telling us that they received some phone calls right before this collision happened, that there was a wrong way driver along I-17, but before they can get to it, that's when this collision occurred. As we take a look from the chopper here, you can still see the scene. The tanker, they tell us, was carrying 800 pounds of diesel fuel. Luckily, that sedan that that struck the tanker only pierced the uh, main tank, spilling out just a little bit of fuel there. The driver was able to get out of that car with no injuries. That car then flew over the ramp, landing uh, below the I-17 stack, sending debris over to I-17, causing a second collision. Luckily, there were no injuries in that collision there. Investigators at this point taking their measurements, doing everything they can to wrap up this investigation. But for now, as Gina mentioned, they have I-17 northbound open, but the ramps are still closed.